Welcome to Electra Online. Here we'll take a look at the pyramid. We need to find the volume of a pyramid and the surface area of a pyramid. The volume will be a lot like the right circular cone. It's the area of the base times the height times some fraction. It turns out the fraction again is one third. So what we can say here is that the volume equals one third the area of the base. In this case it would be S squared times the height, which would be h. And so simply said, v equals one-third s square h. But what about the surface area? That's a little bit more tricky because the sides are slanted. So what we need to do is find the area of the triangle that's made by the side. And to do that, you have to realize that the height of each triangle, I call it h prime, is not the height of the actual pyramid. It's longer. If you draw a right triangle here, you can see that this would be the height of the triangle, this would be the bottom of the triangle, and this would be the hypotenuse. So let's take that over here and draw it on the side. So here we have the height, the slanted height, and the base. This would be h, this here would be h prime, which is what we're looking for, and this would be half the length or the side of the base, that would be s over 2, and then you realize that h prime squared equals h squared plus s over 2 quantity squared, or h prime equals the square root of h squared plus s over 2 squared. That's how we find the slanted height of a pyramid. Then to find the area of a single triangle, we can say that the area of the triangle is equal to one half the base, which is s, times the height, which is the slanted height, which is h prime, or one half s times the square root of h squared plus the quantity s over two squared. Now we're ready to find the surface area of the entire pyramid. The surface area of the pyramid would be equal to the surface area of the base, plus four times the surface area of each of the triangles. And we have the area of the triangle right here. So then we can say that the surface area is equal to the area of the base, which is S squared, plus four times the surface area of a single triangle, which is one half S times the square root of H squared plus half of S quantity squared. And simplifying that, because we have a 2 here and a 4, we can say that the surface area is equal to s squared, which is the surface of the base, plus 2 times s times the square root of h squared plus the quantity s over 2 squared. And there is the equation we can use to find the surface area of a pyramid. And here we have the equation of the volume of a pyramid. And that's how it's done.